first look at MIUI 9.3.1 beta on the Xiaomi Poco F1. If you haven't already subscribed, make sure you subscribe to the channel and click on the bell icon to get notified of new videos. Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video. And in this video, we're going to have a first look at MIUI 10 9.3.1 beta on the Xiaomi Poco F1. Let's get the elephant out of the room first. Let's go into settings, scroll down, go into lock screen and password, click on manage fingerprints. Make sure you have a fingerprint set up on this guy and enter your pin. Then click on fingerprint payments and you have Widevine L1 in the building. Click on this guy and make sure the payment status is available and certificate number is set to one. If it is set to anything else other than these settings, all you need to do is click on certificate, make sure you're connected to the internet and it will download the Widevine L1 certificate on your POCO F1. Other than that, we can also check by opening the DRM info application and bam, there it is, Widevine L1 in the building. Xiaomi has kept its promise and we have Widevine L1 on the latest beta for the Xiaomi POCO F1 and I'm pretty sure it will come out on the next stable build as well. Having Widevine L1 support also means you can now watch Amazon Prime content and Hotstar content in 1080p. As for Netflix, I'm not sure what's going on. From what I have read, Netflix is not whitelisting the Xiaomi Poco F1 and that is something which Xiaomi and Netflix might have to figure out. But yes, you can watch HD content on Amazon Prime videos and Hotstar. Next up, we also have 4K 60fps in the building. Open the camera application, go into video, click on the hamburger menu on the top right, go into settings, click on video quality and bam, there you have it, 4K 60fps and 1080p 60fps on your Xiaomi Poco F1. Let's enable 4K 60fps, click on the back button and there you have it. This 4K UHD which you see in your viewfinder. On the top right is also something new which was added in this latest 9.3.1 beta. Other than that, you also have the ability to lock your apps using your face unlock data. So we go into settings, scroll down, look for the app lock option, this guy. It is telling me to use my fingerprint or enter my password. I'll use my fingerprint, fingerprint one more time. And we are in the app unlock menu. Let's go into settings. And there you have it, face unlock is enabled, which means I can now lock and unlock my applications using the face unlock. Another new option which I saw, but I'm not sure whether it was part of this beta or the previous beta, but I would like to mention it. Let's go into settings, scroll up a little bit, go into full screen display, this guy over here, and bam, we also have the option to hide the notch, enable this guy and the notch is now hidden. However, our notifications have shifted down and we are not using the notch area to show anything, which means we are kind of wasting space, but it is good to see Xiaomi add the option back again. Like I said, I'm not sure whether it was included in the previous beta or not, but I did notice it in this 9.3.1 beta, so I thought I would let you peeps know. Also, I went ahead enabled developer options to check whether the MIUI 10 dark theme is enabled in this guy or not. So go into additional settings, look for developer options. And no, we do not have the option to enable dark mode or night mode in this beta, but I'm pretty sure once Xiaomi is done theming all its applications and the settings menu, we will have dark mode with MIUI 10 on our Xiaomi Poco F1. As for the security patch, if we go into settings, about phone, the security patch is from 1st of February 2019. Now, those of you who want to install this beta, I have a link for the full ROM in the description of this video. Download that guy, go into system update, click on the three dot menu on the top right and click on choose update package. If you do not get the option of choose update package, all you need to do is tap on this 10 seven times. It will give you a message down here and then choose update package will be enabled. And of course, if you click on the three dot menu, click on what's new and check Xiaomi's change log for this MIUI 9.3.1 beta. 
they do not give you any information they have a generic message which they have with every update which is optimized system performance and improved system security and stability all i can say about that is i laugh out loud whenever i read it show me if you're watching this video please add a proper change log so this is what is new in xiaomi's miui 10 global 9.3.1 beta for the xiaomi poco f1 i hope my video helped you likes shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome see you when i see you <music>